Story kubwa kule mitandaoni ni story ambayo ina trend sana ya afisa wa polisi ambaye anajulikana kama Caroline Kangogo ambaye alihusishwa na mauaji ya wanaume wawili. Sasa blog kubwa ya hapa nchini Kenya tuko wame share profile ya polisi huyu ambaye sasa hivi ameenda missing tangu siku ya tokeo. Kulingana na tuko wameandika Caroline Kangogo profile of police woman accused of killing Nakuru Cope uh, 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 and Juja Man. Kanileo kasema Caroline Kangogo is the prime suspect in the cold-blooded shooting of Constable John Ongweno and Peter Ndwiga. Kangogo was born in 1987 in Kamugich, Elgeo Marakwet County uh, to Banaba Kipkoech Kip Koril and Lea Kangogo. She is Christian by faith and her parents said she was brought up like a normal uh, uh, child. In 2008 she joined Kenya Police uh, College in Kiganjo. Sasa hapa wanachokisema ni kwamba Caroline Kagongo ni mshukiwa um, wa mauaji uh, John Ongweno na Peter Ndwega na Kagongo alizaliwa mwaka wa 1987 kule upande wa Kamugich Elgeo Marquet uh, na wazazi wake ambao ni babake na mamake ambao ni Banaba Kipkoech Koril na Lea Kangongo. Uh, yeye ni Mkristo ambaye alilelewa kama watoto wengine wote. Ikiwa mwa, mnamo mwaka wa 2008 alijiunga na shule ya wanapolisi kule Kiganjo. Wakaendelea wakaeleza hapa chini na kusema Caroline Kagogo a rogue police officer described as armed and dangerous by the directorate of criminal investigations this year is still on the loose as of Thursday July 8th. Wanachosema hapa ni Caroline Kagongo amesemekana kuwa uh, mwanamke hatari sana ambaye amejihami na maafisa wa kitengo cha DCI ambao wanadai kwamba tangu siku ya tokeo hajaonekana hadi leo hii na picha yake basi tuko wakaiweka hapo sasa chini tuko waliendelea na kueleza haya uh, the police officer now uh, forgetive shocked the nation with her horrific uh, transgressions that claimed the the Uh, the lives of two men believed to have been in a romantic relationship with her. Uh, okay, sasa hapa wanachokisema ni kwamba afisa huyu wa polisi aliwashtua uh, wengi kwa uh, hii story yake ambayo ina trend lakini ikawa inasemekana kwamba uh, hawa wanaume wawili ambao aliowaua inasemekana walikuwa katika mahusiano ya kimapenzi. The towering corporal is the prime suspect uh, in the cold-blooded shooting of Constable John Ogweno in Nakuru and another man Peter Ndwega in Thika less than 24 hours later. Okay, tuko hapo chini. Wakaendelea na kusema but who is Kagongo? Tuko brings you uh, a brief profile of the killer a cop uh, who has escaped the police uh, dragnet uh, for three days uh, running now sasa hapa wameeleza sasa maelezo uh, zaidi kuhusiana na Caroline ambapo wameandika haya Kagongo's early life and education Kagongo was born in 1987 in Kamugich Elgeo Marakwet County to Banaba Koril and Lea Kagongo She is the firstborn in the family. And she is a Christian by faith and her parents uh, said she was brought up like a normal child. Uh, the officer started her education at Nyawa Nursery in 1993. She later joined Nyawa Boarding Primary School. Uh, she did her uh, Kenya Certificate of Primary Education KCPE in 2004 and scored 305 marks out of 500. She later joined Alfenius Mutei Girls School and scored C- in her Kenya Certificate of Secondary Education KCSE. She joined Keo Professional Counselors uh, where she acquired a certificate of basic skills uh, in peer uh, counseling. Kuendelea na kusema joining Kenya Police in 2008 
She joined uh, Kenya Police uh, College in Kiganjo. She attained a first class in shooting range uh, classification. In 2014, uh, she trained as a corporal in the same learning institution. Security pundits uh, deduced uh, that the suspect might be using her shooting skills to kill her targets without sounding an alarm and evading arrests. Okay, wakanelewa wakasema uh, police station ambayo alikuwa kifanyia kazi. Kagongo has served in four different police stations. In 2008, she served as the Mombasa Police Training College uh, at the Mombasa Police Training College. Between 2010 and 2013, she was uh, stationed at Kaloleni Police Station in 2013 to 2015. Uh, she served at the Kenya Police College in Kiganjo. From 2015 uh, to date, Mbaka Sasaivi, Kagongo served as a corporal at the Central Police Station in Nakuru. Wakaeleza sasa mambo yake ya ndoa ambapo waliandika, the killer suspect was married uh, to a senior police officer attached uh, to the uh, maritime police unit in Mombasa and together were blessed with two kids uh, aged 8 years and 11 years. Her marriage however was troubled and she allegedly fought with uh, with him in public over uh, infidelity. Uh, the duo later separated but agreed to co-parent. Sasa hapa wanasema kwamba uh, Carol alioleka uh, kwa uh, mwana polisi mwenzake na wakabarikiwa na watoto wawili lakini baadaye wakawa na kutoelewana kidogo wakapigana na basi wakawa hawaishi pamoja tena na kuachana lakini wanaendelea kuwalea watoto wao wawili uh, vizuri mtoto wao wa kwanza ana miaka 11 lakini wa pili ana miaka 8 wakaendelea kusema before the killing scandal, Kagongo lived with uh, their two children, uh, but the husband has since taken uh, them. Tangu sasa, hiyo siku ya tokeo. General conduct, wameandika na kusema, according to some of the colleagues, uh, she is uh, an amiable person with a calm and cheerful uh, attitude. Uh, can learn kusema, however, others said she doesn't fear a confrontation and a many a time response with force when threatened in a way. A lively person who prefers uh, the company of men, uh, the forgetive is said uh, to be an officer who tackles uh, issues ahead uh, or head on uh, really ducks. As she is believed to have been a sex worker besides her work in the police service. She entertained men with money and would break up once uh, once the money is finished and most of the um, uh, of the time men would fight over her. Sasa hapa unachokiona sasa. Anasema kwamba yeye uh, ifanya kazi uh, kama uh, sex worker. Uh, na basi um, wakati mwingine uh, company yake ikawa ni ya wanaume ambao baadaye wanakuja kumpigania. Kwa hiyo unaona kiasi gani ambacho story hii inaendelea kuwashtua wengi. Na sasa tuko wameeleza sasa haya ni maelezo machache ambayo anamhusu Carol ambaye sasa hivi haonekani tangu siku ya tokeo ambalo lilitokea uh, kwa kuwaua wanaume wawili uh, Nakuru na Juja. Kwa hiyo ndio hiyo story yake ambayo sasa hivi inaenda sana kule mitandaoni ambapo wa Kenya kweli kweli wanazungumza uh, kuhusiana na history lakini zaidi ya hapo maafisa wa kitengo cha DCI nadhani wanazidi kufuatilia kwa ukaribu zaidi na nadhani iwapo atasarenda au kujipeleka mwenyewe nadhani au maafisa wa itakuwa rais kwa maafisa wa polisi labda kusol hiyo issue ambayo iliweza kutokea Lakini ndio hivyo tuko wameeleza machache kumhusu Carol. Wewe nawe mtazamaji wa Swift Media. Kutokana na hii story yote unaichukuliaje? Unadhani alifanya kitu cha aina gani? Na kama basi alikuwa na mahusiano na hao wawili, wanaume wawili kama inavyosemekana, unachukulia swala hilo kama la aina gani? Kwa sababu of late 
mambo haya ya maua watu kuuana katika mahusiano ya kimapenzi yamekuwa kitokea kwa muda sana lakini sasa ndio haya tena afisa wa polisi amewaua wawili hao na basi sasa hivi hapatikani lakini anazidi kutafutwa kulingana na hizi taarifa ambazo tunazo ziona huku. Niambi unachukulia vipi hayo hapo kwenye sehemu ya comments lakini subscribe kwa ajili ya kupata taarifa mpya kila wakati.